Hey everyone, it's Yadi G and today I have my first ever haul video for you and as you can tell by the box behind me, it's definitely a Zara haul. Um, for Black Friday slash Cyber Monday or the Cyber Week, they had a 40% off sale on their website and I got a bunch of stuff from there so I'm really excited to show you guys this is again my first video or my first haul video but also my first video on YouTube I really want to start doing more videos on here um, I love YouTube I love clothes and I buy a lot of it so why not <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy it it is a try on haul so I will be trying on these pieces for you guys too and linking everything at the in the description box below as well so hopefully you guys like it again I'm really excited for this so uh let's just get to it <laughs> this is the beautiful box so my packages came in four boxes which was insane pretty crazy but whatever um okay so for the first piece is um a crop top that I bought and I bought it in two different colors I seen it on their website and I thought it would be so cute um, and I've tried them on already so if they have little fuzzy stuff on there don't mind them but this is the shirt here um, it's just a white shirt and I think it's really really cute how you can um, how it's ruched here in the middle it looks really cute on um, I definitely think that this with some jeans leather pants it would look super cute. Um, it was $17.90. But again, I got it for 40% off. Also, I got it in brown. I don't know what happened this season, but the brown color definitely came back into style. And I'm actually here for it. Not gonna lie. No, not gonna lie. I'm here for it. So next piece of clothing I have been seeing everywhere. And I love it I fell in love with it and it was going um actually I believe that this top wasn't on sale but it's this top here gorgeous um this top is so freaking nice it looks so nice on it's um like a spandex material and if you've seen other youtubers talk about it or other like influencers I should say talk about it they do tell you to size up and listen to them. <laughs> um, the awesome thing is that you can ruche it here at the bottom. So you can make this as like crop toppy as you want it. Or you can put it all the way down and wear it more as a shirt. So if you don't really want to show stomach, I can probably get away with wearing this top for work. Next is another brown top. Um, and it's this one here. Let me make sure you guys can see it. It's so cute. It has um, for you to tie it at the waist. So you can either tie it from the front or you could tie it from the back. Um, this top is so cute. It's a ribbed material as well. You guys will definitely see that here a lot. I did get it in a size small. And my only thing is that I wish that they had an extra small because it fits me a little loose from the arms. Um, so it fits me a little loose, like from the armpit area, which I'm not like super mad at it, you know, um, it still looks nice and I can still make it work, but I do wish that they had this in an extra small because I think an extra small would look so nice. So next piece, it's this black ribbed, um, button up shirt and it looks so cute on like. I work in an office setting so I can definitely wear this to the office but as well like let's say you're gonna go out after somewhere which right now probably nowhere but um, if you were to go out somewhere you can like just unbutton a button and then it looks super cute you can kind of wear it like a cardigan I think you that's how it would look super cute um, with some leather pants again almost everything I bought with leather pants would look amazing um, again, it's also ribbed. It's a ribbed shirt. Shocker. Um, it was $29.90, but this one was also part of the sale, and I got a size small. <laughs> so my next shirt, so this wasn't part of the sale either, but I had to get it. It's this shirt here. I know it probably looks a little weird, <laughs> but this shirt is so, so cute. Um, 
I have been seeing it, like I said, all over YouTube, and I've seen other YouTubers wearing it, but it is a ribbed material, super thick and stretchy. Look at this. Um, it has like balloon sleeves almost, but then it's super tight here at the, at the end, which if you know me also, this is kind of my favorite sleeve. I have a couple of shirts like this, or like, I guess like sweaters in a way. I love how it's like a crop top, but it's like, and it's loose fitting. Oh, it's just great. I live in California and the weather over here, it may be December, but it really feels like it's like October, September maybe. So it's not that cold. So right now all this stuff is perfect to wear. Um, but oh my God, this shirt is so nice. Um, so again, it wasn't on sale. It was $39.90. Um, 40 bucks so a little pricey but honestly this material is so thick and it, I just I love this shirt it's so nice so last shirt to this definitely um, a more simple selection I guess you could say is this one here um, so this is just a regular plain uh, long sleeve shirt from Zara um, it is really thin and I kind of don't like it <laughs> I'm kind of iffy about it. We'll see. Um, I did get in a size small and I believe it was only $10 with the sale. Um, like $11, $10. It was, it's $19.90 originally. So if this was, um, not on sale, I would probably never get it. $19.90 for a shirt that's like super thin. I def definitely don't think that's worth it. But the only reason why I'm thinking about keeping it, because again, I do live in California, so it doesn't get super, super cold. So if I want a shirt to wear under, um, under a coat or a jacket and it's not super cold outside and I don't want to wear something thick where I might get hot um this shirt seems like it will be the perfect option um, it's okay I guess it's not that big of a deal um it's a basic but I do wish it wasn't see-through that's like my only thing I just wish it wasn't see-through but for 10 bucks not mad at it um, so my sister has this dress, so I've already tried it on. I've seen it before and I really liked it. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get it because there's something about sharing clothes that sometimes I'm like, no, let's not do it. You know, we honestly share everything, but this dress is super cute. And I'm sure that you guys have seen it in other, um, YouTubers as well, but it's this dress here. So it's a ribbed dress. There's that ribbed word again, right? <laughs> it's a ribbed dress and it also ruches from the side. Um, so you can make it shorter, you can make it longer. So again, um, a rule of thumb for me or something that I kind of go by when I'm shopping is if I can wear it to work and style it for outside of work, it's a perfect piece for me. Honest to God, it's perfect. So the fact that I can wear this to work, but also like make it shorter wear some heels or like throw some shoes on if i'm going out casual um is perfect but this dress is so nice the color is so nice and because it does ruche on the side it shapes you really good um i did get a size small i believe yeah i did get a size small i do kind of want the black one just because this is a great like basic piece to have in your wardrobe. This dress is honestly super cute. My sister wore it for Thanksgiving, which is in our um, Thanksgiving weekend vlog. So if you guys wanna check that out, I will link it down below. She wore it with some thigh high boots and they look so good. Okay, so that was all for the shirts. I'm going to move on to three bottom pieces that I have, which two are the same, just different colors. So let me start off with the two of the same. So I bought this piece thinking that it was another piece, but I love it. <laughs> so I bought this or these, um, ribbed, awkward, ribbed, um, I bought these ribbed leggings. So I thought that these were part of the, um, shape, I think it's like their shapewear collection or not shapewear but there are these other leggings that are practically the same color and they're also ribbed. So when I received them, I realized that they weren't the ones that I thought it was gonna be, but I am not disappointed. These leggings are so cute. They fit so good. I don't have anything that's this color. This is like a brown, almost burgundy color and it looks 
so good on. I'm really picky when it comes to leggings. Um, so I usually like them to be pretty thick and not see-through. And I'm pretty sure that's all of us here. Um, you know, having or buying leggings that are see-through just makes things a little uncomfortable. But these and they shape still really nice. So they might not be part of their shapewear, but they still shape really nice i just i fell in love and i'm really happy because i bought these and then i bought them in black <laughs> so i bought the black ones too um and they're they're great i absolutely i'm so happy that i bought the black ones because if i didn't i would have really regretted it just having these ones because because i don't think i have black leggings that i can say like i reach for or that i'm in love i don't think i really wear leggings as much but now that i bought these i will honestly be wearing these so much more so these are really cute and uh, so i got a ooh, what size did i get them i got a small in both of them and they were originally originally 1990 and i bought them for i believe it was like 11 dollars for both of them and so buying these for 11 dollars that's a really good price so last pants piece that I got or bottoms that I got and that is these here so they are the they're leggings and they are this suede material um ah there's hair on it of course there's hair everywhere with this damn hair um they are a suede material and oh my god I'm obsessed um they're really stretchy um but oh my god they fit like a glove on me i did get i believe an extra small yeah i got an extra small they're originally 39.90 but i'm pretty sure i got them god probably for 20 22 which i can i will again link everything down at the bottom unfortunately the sale is over but 39.90 for these i think are worth it this is honestly so cute i absolutely love these leggings i don't have any type of bottoms this color so these leggings will look really cute with some of the brown tops that I got. Um, even with like this top. Ooh, that one's cute. I think you guys should just do it. Just put it down. So that is all for the shirts and bottoms. So now we're going to get into the good stuff. And that's the coats and all those fun stuff. For the first coat, it is this coat here um so last year this coat was a bomber jacket material on the outside and this year it's a suede material on the outside and i personally did not realize it when i bought it i really wanted the bomber jacket material but i really wanted that one so when i got it i was a little disappointed which i'm still kind of debating about the jacket but nevertheless um it's still really cute so it's a reversible jacket so you can have it on the suede side or you can have it on the first side so as you guys can see the first side is all throughout the sleeves um this is such such a warm jacket no but i did get an extra small in this jacket and it already feels really um it fits really slouchy but it's really cute i personally don't recommend oversizing because i can fit a um i can fit like a sweater underneath if i wanted to uh but i think an extra small is a perfect fit for me um but this is so cute i love it i love how big it fits i love how warm it is again i do or i did want the bomber jacket material but i understand why they went for the suede since it is a reversible jacket having the suede material is a lot more comfortable if you wanted to wear the fur side on the outside the suede material being on the inside is kind of it still keeps you warm and it feels really nice on your skin so so i also bought this um this piece here uh i it was just i seen it i've seen it in store and i kind of have always wanted to get it um which is just this zip up hoodie and it has kind of balloon sleeves type way um because it, it has bigger it has bigger sleeves and then it's like really tight here at the bottom um and it is 
it does have a zipper the only thing it has no pockets so it does suck but it's okay um it is a cropped hoodie zipper hoodie and i do like how it it does fit how when you close it it fits tight at the waist yeah i got a small in it and so i would probably if i were to buy another one maybe size up maybe go for a medium um so it can fit a little bit more um give me that oversized fit maybe for it just because you know it's a hoodie you want it to be a little bit more comfortable but it's really warm i love it to wear under like leather jacket or under other jackets because of how warm it is and since it doesn't have pockets it's not something that you know you would want to wear just by itself necessarily because if your arm if your hands are cold you can't slip them into the pockets you know but so next jacket is a jacket that I, I have also been eyeing for for quite some time so the coat that i'm talking about is this one here um it kind of reminds me obviously like of a leather jacket but it's a suede material um it's such a nice jacket i absolutely love it um it has buckles and i love the leather detailing that it has on on the jacket um the inside is all uh what is this like a sherpa material so all throughout the sleeves it's sherpa and you see it has like the belt does not go all the way around the belt just goes up here in the front so it's more for like a look or so um i did get this in a small so i will say that i kind of wish i got an extra small in this jacket the small fits me a little loose and i kind of like it when it fits more fitted um i'm not mad at it because i can make it work so it's not anything crazy so but it's still such a cute coat like or jacket um i can see me wearing this all the time um with my with pants with slacks if i need to wear them to work heels boots this is such a cute coat um if it wasn't on sale i don't think i would have bought this for 119 dollars so the fact that it was on sale is the reason why I got it because I have been eyeing it, but for $119, I'm not 100% sure if this is something for me personally worth it. If it's per if it's if you believe it's worth it for you, go for it. It would make a really cute Christmas present, not gonna lie. So next piece that I got, it's this blazer here. It is an olive green, and I believe it's called like the extra long blazer because it's pretty long. Um which you guys will see but this blazer is so so cute um when i first bought it i when i first tried it on i was so iffy about it um, and my sister was the one that was like just style it style it so i'll show you guys how i styled it and i absolutely love it it is something completely different than what i have in my wardrobe um it's very boxy the shoulder it has shoulder pads here um it's the material of this blazer is so thick nice definitely worth it i got this blazer on sale but it's originally 89.90 i personally got an extra small which thank god i did um because it fits me it already fits me pretty oversized as an extra small i am five four and a half five five um and i the length was pretty spot on if i can wear this as a dress or i can wear this as a blazer so when i was styling it i was like okay this is a pretty different piece than any piece that i have in my wardrobe so styling was a little um challenging which i loved because i'm like okay you know sometimes you don't want to step outside of your comfort zone but then when you do you're like dang this is a nice piece of clothing that i have and i want to keep it and the material of it can i just can tell it's something that's going to probably be in my wardrobe for a good amount of time so next piece um was actually not part of the sale but i had to get it um and it is this long it's like a off-white kind of more of a cream um cardigan which we can call the coat again um i know you can it's kind of hard for you to see it here but in the try on you'll see it um so this coat again is such a soft and thick material um i know a lot of people compare it to the mango coat again um 
is it mango or aritzia i believe it's mango coat again which i can also link at the bottom but um i know people have been comparing this to that one i personally don't know how that one feels i don't own it or anything like that but i have seen it and it's a really popular piece um but this is just amazing i love the sleeves i love how they're not like super tight but they're not super wide either um the material is really stretchy um but it's so thick and you could tell it's going to keep you warm um the length was what i was kind of worried about again i'm five foot and a half, five four and a half or five five um and I think it fits great. I don't think it's too long. I don't think it's too short or anything like that. So it fits me really nice from the length. If I wear heels, it's going to show my heels. It's going to look super cute. Um, but I, when I bought this piece, I just imagined it with an all black outfit underneath. And then just the boom, the pop of white over it. Oh my God, that's going to look so nice. So. so the next piece, I bought it very impulsively. It's this jacket here. Um, it is a puffer jacket. It is a longer puffer jacket. You know, I would say like mid length. It has a fur hood. It has a fur hood or a fur outlined hood, I should say. And it is gorgeous. So this jacket, um, oh, it also has a belt that goes around, which it's hard to show you guys now. So you will see in the try on. But this coat or this jacket is amazing. It does have um, this warm material inside, but it's only here at the chest area. It does not go through the through the arms or down here either, which is great because it doesn't um, make you look bulky. You know how if it was all all throughout, you could probably look a little bulky. Um, and I love that it comes with the belt. The belt makes uh makes defines your waist more so it just shapes you nice because we all know coats and puffer coats can make you just look super straight so if you want if you're like me and you like something to shape you a little bit nicer this is such a great coat i love the length and the awesome part too is that it's made out of real down um so it's so warm we love to go snowboarding we love to go to the mountains um it does still get cold and things like that so this is going to be a perfect coat for that or ha ah, jacket a perfect jacket for that and i'm really excited to wear it out so last piece of clothing that i have in this haul honestly so cute i love love blazers um and this blazer is everything to me so let me show you it is this blazer right here the lighting is starting to get yellow so i'm trying to rush through this a little bit but it's this blazer right here. It is so amazing. It is a tweeted um, double-breasted blazer and it has these gorgeous gold buttons. Yeah, gold buttons on them. And it just gives me like such a Chanel vibe. It is so cute. The length of it is amazing on me. Um, I Again, I love blazers and I said it before, I work in an office setting. So I can definitely see me wearing this a lot. I have plain black blazers and everything like that. And I do have an obsession with them. But this one, I have, I don't have anything like this blazer. So I'm really excited to wear it out. I did get an extra small in this blazer. Now, um, I'm not someone who likes to wear things really oversized. So that's the reason why I got an extra small. But it fits me perfect if it's so amazing so i'm definitely really excited to style this up and wear this to work it's just definitely something that i see me having in my wardrobe all the like for a very very long time and again i love how it's a tweeted blazer so it's different material that i don't have very chanel-esque vibes and i am here for it there is one last piece and it's actually probably my favorite out of this whole haul and it's so simple but it's something that i will probably wear more than anything here so and that is this belt here um so this belt i'm obsessed it is black velvet material and it has this gold metal accent it is such a cute belt i seen it and i said i need to have that 
I am I love black and gold black and gold is my favorite all my jewelry is gold I don't wear silver I don't know why don't ask um, but the black velvet and the gold, it just looks so nice, which you guys would have probably seen this piece already. Um, I styled the green blazer with it and I was like, this is it. This is such a cute, cute piece. Um, I got it in a size 30, I believe to go around my waist and I need to do one more button. That was the only, the only, the, the smallest size that they had. So I'm going to have to do another, uh, can I say button, another hole in the belt to be able to make it really tight when I want to make something like really cinch in my waist. But I was trying to be light because it's getting yellow because the sun is setting. That is it for this haul. I told you guys it was big. Um, so I hope you guys liked it. I have a lot more video idea that I want to do. I want to style a lot of these clothes and put them on my Instagram and maybe do like a coat collection because I do have a lot of coats as well. Uh, and what's new in my closet because I have things from H&M and other places. So if you guys like this video, please let me know below or like it. Again, you guys can go ahead and subscribe. Um, I'm going to try my best to keep making these. It's definitely something that I've been wanting to do for quite some time. Um, and I'm finally getting to it. So I hope I stick with it. It's something really fun. I like to do it. So we'll see. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.